we think about corporate social responsibility in the context of creating campaigns around it, creating brand action or corporate action around it, we are still kind of thinking about the brand or the company first. And there was a panel that was devoted to a process called intersectionality. It blew my mind, and it's so simple. When someone on the panel said, when you're trying to create corporate social responsibility programs, and by extension creating campaigns or brand action around the corporate social responsibility efforts, start with the end recipient first. Start with that person who's going to get the grant. What are the needs of that person? Start with the family that needs assistance. And what are the needs of that assistance? Start with the kid that needs to find ways of graduation and, and, and not dropping out, or teen moms who need the assistance in order to break through and, and not just get out of the system. Listen to them first and create the campaigns and create the messaging and create the elements of corporate social responsibility in which the brand or the company can participate rather than how it is now where it basically it's what do we do really well we're a financial company we do financial products how do we get more uh, efforts involved in financial literacy we're a health organization how do we get people to be more healthy we're um, a CPG brand how do we create more buy one give one programs those are great that's that's the way to think about it but there's an added element to it and that is how do you empathetically get into the lives into the insight into the spirit, the existential raison d'etre of the end beneficiary, of the person or the community or the nonprofit organization that needs help. And what do they truly need? And oftentimes, we're going to find a lot of insight by starting at the end that ladders up to the top rather than starting at the top and seeing what organizations or what things can happen at the bottom level. So this idea of intersectionality is actually beyond kind of focus grouping. It's beyond qualitative analysis and quantitative analysis. It's really an empathetic, driven, insight generation and problem solving approach to CSR. And I thought that was amazing. And it's something that we're gonna incorporate into the way we think about crafting campaigns and crafting experiences and crafting brand action behalf of our clients. This is a very exciting time. If you're into brand building and doing good, um, the people in this conference, what I refer to as having fire in their eyes. There's an intentionality, there's a desire, there's budget, and there's C-suite buy-in to do really awesome things in this world. And I'm just so grateful to be a part of that in a small way. And I'm so grateful that an organization like the Conference Board is bringing these people together in order to create, for lack of a better word, an entirely new movement in marketing and advertising based around corporate social responsibility. It's awesome. We have an info uh, saying at school, do you give a shit? And I just spent two days with uh, 80 people who truly give a shit. Until next time.